Hello everyone, it's Jean here from the Inky Owl Studio with a flip through on my Traveler's Notebook uh, theme, sewing themed journal and uh, Etsy restock. So the front of it uh, has this uh, lovely cover. This is a cloth cover that's been fused to cardstock. So it's a nice sturdy cover. Just really fell in love with these uh, vintage um, pattern, sewing pattern models there on the front. And uh, there was a tag and on the front with uh, three vintage buttons sewn on and a little tassel here that goes over some vintage lace at the bottom. And it's held together or it's closed with a seam binding ribbon. And it's underneath this tag and it can be slipped out if you don't care for the closing or you want to put in your own. Um, so that can be removed. And we'll get started here on the inside. And I have a three tier pocket with uh, little pieces of uh, journaling cards or note taking or whatever you would like throughout here. A couple words, a little tag. And here's a larger tag here in the very back with some collaging on it. And a little bit of. Um, collaging on the bottom. Here's the first page. Now I've included in here these really cute little hanger paper clips. I think these are just so, so cute. And uh, these are in here. This is, this is holding together the uh, a file folder. Let me take that off. There's a little file folder, like so, for journaling. And here is uh, a vintage sewing book page, some tea stain paper, a journaling card underneath this belly band with a pocket that you can use to store your memorabilia if you would like. Right inside there. And then over here I have ledger paper. I have sewn with uh, a lot of little cloth tabs on a lot of the pages. Here's a glassing bag with uh, journaling cards inside. A collage pocket with some journaling cards. Some graph paper, tissue paper. Here is a little booklet clipped inside here with opportunities for writing. You can put this in your purse, put it on your note stand for taking notes, or leave it inside the journal. Plenty of room for writing. Another pocket with a large tag. It's um, been sewn around a lot of these larger tags I have sewn around them. Here is another large tag in the middle clipped in with one of those hanger paper clips and here is a uh, owl charm. I like to put those in my journals and another pocket Cute as a button. I like this little collage. It has this little, this little paper doll girl in there. Another belly band with an envelope. And a journaling card. Another booklet. I won't take it out, but it's like the last one. The other glassine part of that glassine bag. And a pocket over here. With a cloth tag on top of that one. And another file folder with a hanger paper clip. The la very last uh, inside cover has a envelope with some lace and a larger tag stuffed inside there like so and so that is the journal details of the journal will be on the website and um 
along with this journal, I'm also going to send a very generous packet uh, filled with some scrap paper that I used in the journal, along with uh, paper dolls of varying sizes, uh, some words, little pieces of ephemera, just stuff for you, and some, uh, I've also got some uh, uh, sayings on pieces of paper there, so just something for you to play with and have a good time with. And so that comes along with the journal as well. And I did want to say that my next project, I'm going to be using uh, Ephemera's Garden. It's a design team project with one of her kits. Beautiful hydrangeas. I love these. And I'm going to incorporate this quilt in some way. I believe the colors um, really go very nicely with this kit. So... To see how I put that together, please subscribe and join me again on the next video. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll talk to you later.